Hey everyone and welcome to GT Online Changes and Additions for the week of July 8th to July 20th, 2021. I know that's a weird day for it to end on, but we'll talk about that a little later. Now for this event week, seven new survival maps have made their way into GTA Online today, ahead of what everyone was pretty much expecting. And if you plan on playing any of the new survivals this week, you'll earn yourself a free $100,000. In addition to that, every single survival is paying double money for this event. Free mode events are dishing out triple rewards, which means criminal damage just got a whole lot more lucrative. I believe with triple money, criminal damage gives you a little over 100 grand for winning. If you complete a simian export request, you'll earn yourself the sunset tint oversized shades, and those will be given to you after July 15th. If you don't know, this is like from the text message that simian sends you with the cars to collect, and then when you get inside of them, you get like two stars, and you have to take it to the custom shop to respray it. That's what I mean. The podium vehicle is the Mark II. The retinue mark II that is not the oppressor and i'll be honest i don't think i've ever driven this car online so hopefully i can win it and give it a try and now for the discounts dynasty 8 garages are 40 percent off the slam truck is 40 percent off same goes for the cargo bob the kraken and the toro then at 30 percent off we have the rm10 bambushka the v65 molotov the p45 nakoda the revolter and the vetir and then we have the Twitch Prime bonuses, which are the exact same as they were last week. 70% off of the Buckingham Valkyrie and 80% off of the Sugoi. So that's the end of the event week, but there's a few more things we need to talk about. Let's start with the least exciting one. Near the end of the newswire, they say that they're going to start removing individual jobs to make room for further updates. And that those jobs will be cycled in and out over time as they continue to add to the game. Quite an interesting choice this late in the game's life cycle, but I think it's a good one. There's just so much clutter in the job menus. Rockstar also teased a bit of DLC info in the newswire. They posted this picture with a paragraph stating, GT Online's forthcoming summer update includes the Los Santos car meet, the beating heart of car culture in Southern San Andreas. Keep an eye out on the newswire for more information coming soon. Unfortunately, that doesn't really give us anything new. Nothing in the picture is new either, I don't think. But there is good reason to believe that the update is coming sooner rather than later. This current event week ends on July 20th, which is a little more than a week, and it's also a Tuesday instead of a Thursday when events usually end. This is pretty much textbook when new updates come out, so I think it's safe to assume that the update will release on July 20th, and we should expect to see even more information in the next week or so. Let me know what you guys think of all this in the comments. Are you excited for the summer update? And if you've played the new survival maps, how do you think they are? If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, Feel free to leave a like as well as subscribe to my channel for more guide and PvP related content. Huge thank you to all my channel members for support. If you'd like to become a member for some exclusive perks, you can either use the join button or the link that's down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.